Today we're diving into a very hot topic, really, really important for everyone to know what it means to digitize physical assets. As you know, in a world of ever evolving technology, the line between physical and digital is really blurred. And today we're diving into that transformative journey. Let's roll. Think of digitization as turning a solid diamond into a million pieces of digital shards, each holding a piece of its value. Let's start with real estate. Imagine owning just a fraction of the Eiffel Tower, or maybe even a New York skyscraper. Companies like Realty allow property owners to digitize those assets, letting numerous people invest into fractions. Think of this as one pool of rights, and by tokenizing, you can really, really slice them up into tiny little pieces, which gives so much more liquidity and opens doors to thousands of micro investors. And now let's talk about art. Platforms like Maykenis have changed the game for art collectors. Instead of one person owning a Picasso, many can own a digital share of it without it ever leaving the museum. Diving into to vintage cars and collectibles. Are you or have you ever met someone really passionate about collecting cars? Platforms like Curio Invest now allows you to tokenize them, diversifying investments and ensuring a broader market. Once again, why do we need to go digital? Number one is liquidity. Just like water flows easier than ice, digital assets are easier to trade, increasing their market value. Another great benefit is protection. Blockchain's tamper-proof nature ensures that your assets' history and authenticity are tamper-proof. Diversification. Splitting assets into digital shares allows more people the opportunity to invest, spreading the risk thin and attracting diverse funding sources from all over the world. Think of it this way. Instead of guarding this gold bar in a vault, what if you could split its value across millions of digital vaults? Each vault will have a piece of the gold and together they represent the whole. That's the beauty of digitizing. And for the cherry on top, businesses report an average of 20% increase in asset value after digitization, all due to increased liquidity and market reach. So entrepreneurs, are you curious about the step-by-step? -step? Let me walk you through. Of course, every process begins with research. Understand the value and history of your asset. Make sure that you always consult with financial professionals. The next step would be to choose a platform. Find one that aligns with your asset type and business goals. Number three would be to ensure compliance. Consult with legal professionals to navigate regulations. And finally, engage. Interact with your investor community. I guess what, what really bums me out is that I thought, I thought we got each other. You know, you were my guys, you know. They're your new partners in this journey. In a world that's merging the physical and digital, the opportunities are truly boundless. This goes way beyond owning assets. This reshapes industries and destinies altogether. So gear up pioneers and let's redefine value in this digital age. See you next time.